Hello friends. Today I have another quick tip. I'm going to show you how to transfer animation downloaded from Mixamo to your cat rig in 3D Studio Max. Here we have a character with a fully rigged cat rig. This character is Rikichi from the short film Termite Samurai. The process works best when you upload the same character mesh in Mixamo. First step is to group the character. This will come in handy later. Just go to group and hit group. Now open the group and make sure the character is in T-Pose. Now duplicate the character's base mesh. Detach it from the group by hitting Group Detach. Remove the Turbo Smooth and any other additions in the modifier list. Make sure it is a low poly version of the character for faster rig creation. Export selected mesh as an FBX file. Now upload to Mixamo. Place the markers and wait a few moments. Now we are ready to place an animation. So let's pick something fairly complex. How about climbing down animation? Now we are ready to download. I click 24 frames per second because this is the frame rate I use and keep all the other settings the same. Now hit download. Back in 3D Studio Max, you can now delete the duplicated mesh as it's no longer needed. Now you import the mesh into 3D Studio Max. And if you play it back, you can see the animation. Now group the important model. Select all, go to group and hit group. Now open both groups. Now go to animation, click cat, capture animation. Hide the selected mesh from Mixamo. Click Source Objects and select the Mixamo Pelvis Bone. Then click Target Rig and select the pelvis bone of the character that has been cat rigged. Now click Auto Map. And now you can see the cat rig is transposed over the Mixamo rig. Now if you click on the cat rig mapping, you will see that certain bones are not matched, but that's okay. You can manually connect them or just leave them open. I usually just leave them open. Now hit capture animation. Now close the groups the characters are in by selecting them and going to group close. Now you just delete the original Mixamo rig. Now you have the animation transferred to the cat rig. If you click on the cat rig layer manager, you will see the collapsed layer where the keyframes are stored. Now you can make changes to the animation by adding a local layer. It is a great method to use as a starting point to animate a character or customize the animation from Mixamo. Not only that, you retain all the original facial morph targets and the original rigged facial controls for the character. 
And that's it. I hope you liked this quick tutorial and please subscribe. It really helps the channel grow and there's more content coming your way.